Hey guys! In this video, we'll be showing you four ways to do a bun. These styles are great for relaxed hair, transitioning hair, and of course, natural hair. We'll be showing you how to achieve a bun using your hair and also adding some hair. Just because it's springtime doesn't mean you have to ditch your protective styles. We hope you guys have as much fun watching this video as we did making it for you. What you'll need is a comb, a brush, as many bobby pins as you like, eco styler gel, and a stretched out headband that I'm using for my scrunchie. I'm starting on old stretched hair that was in a braid out and it's best to start on stretched hair. Now I'm spraying my edges with a little bit of water and then I'm also going to put some eco styler gel just to make them more slick. I'm being very gentle with my hair and brushing it with a soft bristle brush upwards. Now I'm taking a section of hair and I'm rolling it under and then I'm going to secure it with a bobby pin. Very simple and you're going to repeat this process through your entire head. The sections can be however big or however small you want. Use as many bobby pins as you like to reinforce the bun. My edge is looking a little rough. So what I'm going to do is tie it down with a cut up stocking. I'm going to tie it down for about 15 minutes or however long I want. Fifteen minutes later and now my edges are more slick. You can do it as long as you want. And here's the final product. Okay, so I'm starting out on old stretched hair. It's like an old blowout, braid out, something like that. I haven't taken my length in a while. Let's check that bad boy out. Hey. Okay. All right, so I'm just slipping up my hair into a high ponytail. I use Eco Styler Gel and water on my edges. Bringing all that hair up into a high ponytail. And I'm using a stretched out, ouchless goodie band for my little top knot. And I'm leaving the ends of my little miniature bun tucked in in the back there. Now y'all, I'm about to take this wee ponytail and show y'all how to make the quickest, easiest bun you've ever seen. This is a drawstring ponytail that I got from my nearest beauty supply store. There's also two cones, one in the front and one in the back on this ponytail. At this point, I'm just putting in the ponytail using the cones and wrapping that drawstring around after I secured the ponytail. Take a bobby pin and hide that string in there. Don't let that string show. You can even wear your ponytail like this if you want. Alright, as you can see, my ponytail is all to the side. This makes it easier to wrap around. I gathered the ponytail at the ends and I just brought it forward in a twisting motion to make sure that the ends stay gathered. Use as many bobby pins as you need to make sure every hair is in place. <laughs> and like I said, the quickest, easiest bun. So on those days where your hair is just looking crazy, you don't feel like washing it, do this. Slick down those edges and go on about your business. Yay! I'm starting with my hair up already from the previous bun. Now I'm going to take a section of hair and then I'm going to make a twist. You can make your twist however big or however small you want. After I finish completing the twist, I'm going to twirl it around and then I'm going to pin it under and secure it with a bobby pin. I'm going to do the same thing for my entire head, twisting and then pinning. And 
and there you go. An easy, twisted, textured bun. Now I'm going to pull it apart and adjust it to how I want it. And here is the final product. Okay, for this bun, this bun is not your everyday bun. This bun was inspired by uh, different photo shoots that I have went to. I'm using two different types of braiding hair. One is Marley, and one is more of the straight textured braiding hair. I took the hair and I intertwined them into two different long twists and then put those two long twists together. Here I took one rubber band and I am fastening the hair onto my bun using a bobby pin. At the ends of this hair, I use black scrunchies to make sure that the hair stay all together. Using one side at a time, I am wrapping this hair around my little bun and using bobby pins to secure it. I have wrapped all the different pieces, the four different pieces, in opposite directions around my bun. I've slicked my edges, and I'm looking like Queen Nefertiti. Yes, I am. So there you have it guys, four ways to do a bun. The first bun, the roll and tuck. The second bun, the drawstring pony bun. Third, twisted texture bun. And the last one is the high fashion I'm a queen bun. Thanks for watching. Make sure you subscribe to our channel and like us on Facebook. We are also on Instagram and Twitter at Unearthed Amber and Charismatic underscore. Work. Break it down, 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 break it down.